Okay, let me talk about this really, really quick because um, black women, you need to know that these people want to profit off of your outrage. I don't know. I don't know if enough black women know this. These people profit off of your outrage. The next time you get mad about what a rich person's doing, just think, just sit back, think about it. Just sit back and think about what is happening. Why is it happening now? Is it worth, is it worth my emotion? Let's talk about this Jesse Nelson black fishing thing. Okay. There's two, there's two things at play here, by the way. Hi, welcome to my channel. I'm Udoka. I talk about my personal life and, but I also talk about things that have caught my attention, such as Jesse Nelson black fishing. And this is my two cents on it. And listen, the thing about me is my two cents is going to get somebody mad, like without fail in every video, somebody gets mad in my comment section. Um, I'm kind of like that. What, who's that one girl that her username is literally my thoughts will offend you will probably offend you. Um, that's me. I think, <laughs> I don't know. I, I don't think I'm saying anything outrageous, but I might be saying something that maybe you didn't think about before, or you, you just, here's, here's the deal. It's just not popular to say what I'm saying, but uh, I'm going to say it because black women, you need to protect your peace. I'm so sorry. We need to be more diligent about protecting our peace and not letting any Tom, Dick and Harry come and try to disturb it. I am, I'm begging you. I'm begging you like for our health, for our health, for our health, please. Okay. Jesse Nelson, people are saying, oh, she's black fishing because of two things. Number one, her new music video was too hip hop, which I think that's just, I'll get to it. And two, because she, she is black fishing. Okay. Um, I mean, I don't know what, 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 what else do you call it? When you are a white woman and you are intentionally making yourself look like a racially ambiguous mixed with black person who is d d d doused in hip hop, what else do you call that? That is, that's black fishing. That's what it is. Here's the thing though. This is not new. Okay. Let me tell you my, how, how I was introduced to Jesse Nelson. By the way, if you don't know, she's part of this band. It's called Little Mix. Hold up. I, I don't know why Americans are acting like they don't know who Little Mix is. Little Mix is band. Okay, get it. Do you see her? That's her, right? That's Jesse. In this band called Little Mix. Ain't nobody talking about black fishing here. Go to the comment. Nobody is complaining about black fishing. Look look again. Look look again with your eye. Nobody's complaining about black fishing Un until today, until today, until she announced that she's leaving. When did she announce it? Cause I saw a video from four months ago. Okay. Little mix is a popular band. Look, a hundred million views on this video. Don't, don't play. Don't play like, Oh, we didn't, we, we didn't talk about the black fishing because we didn't know who she was. Shut up. 15 million subscribers. When she was in the band, Every video, 100 million views. Get out of here. This is an international band, group, girl group. They've won many awards. Metrics. They're from the UK. So don't play. Don't play. Don't act like you've never seen this person before. First of all. So if you've seen this person before, you've seen her black fishing. You've seen it. When I first saw her. Her face gave me very uncanny valley. Listen, I'm not trying to, mm -hmm. I'm not trying to, uh, sh I'm not trying to shame her for getting work done. I'm, I'm just saying I, I could tell work was done. 
And and when you go look at what she used to look like, yeah, work she got work done. Okay, I'm not gonna sit here and analyze everything that she got done, but it's it's pretty obvious, pretty clear that she got work done. Now here's the thing. She has been so the the things and the features that people are like using to say you're black fishing, she's always done. She has always worn wigs from the beauty supply store. I don't know why. Like, I'm not going to get onto a woman for wearing wigs. Like, who knows? Who knows what is issues that she may have or what, what, whatever. Okay. She has always been wearing wigs. She's always been wearing wigs. And where's that one pick? And since she got into the industry, since she started popping, popping, she has been getting tans. She's been getting tan. We can go look at all the little mixed music videos. Um, Don't even mean it. Oh, the See her in the beginning? Right? No tan. She still has a big hair. But then as she goes on to start tanning, more and more. Now, I did not know that people didn't know that this woman was a white woman. I don't know. I mean, people, so much plastic surgery is done and so much black fishing is done that like, we're going to have a generation that legit, they don't, they won't know what a black person looks like. <laughs> oh, I'm pretty confident. I, I, I really believe that's going to be a thing. Like it's getting to the point now that if you're like lighter than the paper bag, Somebody will comment, you're not even black. Um, girl. So my point is, she's been doing this for years, for almost a decade. She has been black fishing. Um, so why today do you want me to be upset about it? Like, why today, though? She's been doing this since 2012. So why is it today you want me to be mad? This is why I feel like, um, black ladies, can we stop? Can we stop giving energy to stupid F-ish? Hello, she just went solo. She just released her first solo song with Nicki Minaj on it. Hello. This is nothing new. This is nothing new. I need more. I need black people to to start recognizing that profiting off of our outrage is nothing new. Especially during these woke times where people pretend to be woke. Um th that this is the new oops, we didn't know. <laughs> right? Kim Kardashian makes a, a clothing line and calls it kimono. Oops. <laughs> I didn't know that kimonos already existed. <laughs> B BS. No, no, no. Listen. Because, <laughs> okay, here's the other thing. This Jesse woman don't care also. She doesn't care. So you're not going to shame her. At least not yet. You're not going to shame her. Why? She has been doing this for a decade. Ain't nobody said nothing to her. Ain't nobody said nothing. Look at what she has to say in response to this backlash. She explained, the whole time I was in Little Mix, I never got any of that. And then I came out of the band and people all of a sudden were saying it. I yeah, when she was in Little Mix, she got fat shamed, body shamed. But I didn't see the, I didn't, I really did not see people discuss her black fishing. I Listen, if I'm wrong and there was like a little faction, I I, I honestly actually would love, love to see it. But on the widespread discussion in on black Twitter, on black YouTube, I didn't see it discussed. She was worried about her weight back then. She was worried about people talking about her weight. I wasn't on social media around that time, so I let my team deal with it. Yeah, she got off social media because she was just she was tired of people talking about her weight. 
Not nothing to do with black fiction. Because that was when I had just left. Jesse continued on saying, but I mean, I love black culture. I love black music. That's all I know. It's- That's how you know she don't care. Ma'am, we didn't ask you whether or not you loved black culture or black music. That's not, that's not the question. That's not the assignment. That's not what's on the pop quiz. That you are being accused of black fishing. How do you respond? We, black fishing does not mean you don't love black culture. It does not mean you don't love black music. I'm sure you do. <laughs> the, the, uh, we, we are very sure that you do <laughs> you see what i'm saying like she's acting like she doesn't understand what the issue is she's she's acting like she she's never heard like she doesn't know what black fishing is so she don't know what that is and the, this is what they do Ooh, oops Ooh, oops didn't know oops that's what they do i mean this is nothing yo we have been seeing this. Like, this is not new. And I don't, I don't like people stressing out about it like it's new. And here's the, thing, here's the other thing. Nobody's been talking to her about this. The fans haven't been talking to her about it. Why do you think she's going to listen today? Like, she's dropping her solo. Why, why do you think she, she's going to listen today? Because she's probably also thinking, why today? Well, why, why, why y'all talking about this today? Of, of all the years, I've been looking how I've been looking. Y'all decide this month is going to be the month to, to. I would also, I mean, I, I don't blame her if she's like, oh, you're just a hater. Because nobody's talked to her about it. This is not the, this is the kind of thing that the person has to be, edu- I mean, they have to be educated. They have to be pushed to get some education to understand, okay, understand why is this marginalized group of people telling you something? <laughs> but I, I just feel very sus about why Why is it now that we care? Because I didn't see people caring before. Now, if you have been caring this whole time, then this is an exciting time because now you're like, yes, finally, let's discuss it. But for everybody who hadn't been on that train, why why did you decide to care today? You need to think about why, what is being presented in front of you that's dealing with black issues and why is it being presented to you? Why are they presenting this black fishing to you on the week that she releases her first solo? Like you got to think like y'all need to understand that this idea of profiting off of the negative emotions and hurt of black people, especially black women. This is a marketing tactic. It is. And you just provide and you're providing the free labor. With your outrage. It's, you know, the. The other thing that we like is we like when people keep the same energy. So when there's a shift in the energy, it's like you got to question what, 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 where did that happen? Where did that come from? Now, here's the other thing. I just disagree with this next thing. And I'm sorry, you, you, you just not going to get me pressed about it. You just, I don't know, leave me a comment. You can leave me a comment, but I'm not going to be pressed about this now. People don't like. They don't like how hip hop it is. It just seems very hip hop, right? I don't know why people are playing dumb. She is paying homage to Bad Boys for Life. Somebody said, there's a difference between paying homage and copying. Who's the boss? Dudes is lost. No crap she's copying. Are you kidding me? Like, what, you think we're stupid? No, 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 no. You saw, I showed you the clips from her video. Here's the clips from Bad Boys for Life video. Hello? <laughs> Listen to the song. Hey, you got the wire. If not, I- yes. Yes, it's a it's a copy. Duh. Dude. 
Duh. <laughs> it's a copy. This is made by P. Diddy. And then guess who's in her video? Hi. Can you guess who's in her video? Hey, hey, Jeezy, ooh, 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 ooh. Jesse, Lil Mix, whatever y'all calling yourselves, D. Diddy's in her video. Diddy co-signed her copy. So I'm sorry. You want me to be upset that she copied Diddy's video when Diddy likes it? And endorses it, but I need to, but I need to be upset. No, the, the actual people involved, the copier and the copied have an agreement that they're happy with, but I, I myself, I need to be the one that's upset. No, I'm, can somebody make that make sense for me? Why do I need to, I need to lend my emotions for something that the person who should be offended ain't offended about. So what? Why should I? Why? Why do I need to care more than Diddy? Can somebody explain? I'm waiting for someone to. I'm waiting for somebody to explain. Why do I need to all of a sudden care that she's black fishing when she's been doing it this whole time? I've been thinking it this whole time. I, 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 I know. It's like, oh, she's been exposed for black fishing. Excuse you. I, I've been known. <laughs> I, I've been knowing. I don't know how you're just now discovering it, but I need to be extra outraged. And I also need to be outraged that she's copying Diddy, but Diddy endorses it. No, none of it makes sense. And I just, I haven't seen an argument that that makes me believe that there is a good reason for me to bring out my emotional bag baggage and, and, and weep for this. And I have a feeling I'm not the only black woman. I mean, I, I'm watching some of these black women comments about this situation and I can tell sis, I can tell, I can tell you also just, you couldn't be paid to give a damn. I can tell, but you can hear how the way they're reporting it, they're reporting it in such a way so that nobody can say nothing to them. But it's like, girl, you, you, you don't care. Just say you don't care. Because when, when you first realized it, you cared. When you saw that nobody cared, you try to move on with your life. Now that all of y'all care, you want me to, to reinvigorate anger. No, listen, black women, you need to understand that people want to profit off of your outrage. That people want to pretend that they that they're on board with your outrage. They want to pretend. They want to pretend because she been looking like this for all these years. All of a sudden, now you now you have a problem with it. No, I don't. I don't. But why? How am I supposed to believe that? No, they want to pretend that they're with our outrage. So, and they're gonna profit off of it. It's just like these fake woke people, these people who pretend that they woke, but they not. You got to You got to be vigilant. You got to be vigilant. You got to understand there are people who are trying to suck. They're really trying to suck your joy. They really are. They're trying to suck out your peace for their own benefit. Don't let them. Mm -mm, don't let them. Don't let them. I just had to give my two cents on this, how I really feel. I tend to make, my opinions tend to be unpopular. Um, I'm going to start putting unpopular opinion on my videos because my opinions tend to be unpopular for whatever reason. If you think what I'm saying doesn't make sense, then make what you're saying make sense. In the comments below, like this video. If you actually like it, subscribe if you vibe with me because I don't always post the same kind of content. I I post whenever I feel impassioned about something and I felt I felt impassioned about this because I could hear it. Listen, go to, go to any black woman's commentary on this. Now, I'm not saying there, there, are, there are some black women who actually are like, oh my gosh, black fishing. 
but most of the black women I'm seeing, I can, I can just hear it in the tone. They don't give a damn <laughs> girl. You can hear it in the tone. You can hear it in the tone when she's talking about, well, you know, Diddy was in the video. So just tell me what you think in the comment. Girl, just go ahead and say you don't give a damn either. <laughs> you know, the, the, you'll hear the lady, she'll be saying like, you know, Jesse has, people are accusing Jesse for black fishing. She's been black fishing for quite some time now. And people have an issue with how hip hop her video is. But on the other hand, Diddy's in the video. Let me know your thought. Girl, just say you don't care. Just, say, <laughs> just tell the girls the truth. Tell the girls that our outrage doesn't need to be given to every dick Tom and Harry to profit off of. Just go ahead and tell the girls. Go ahead and tell the girls that as black women, we should be able to relax. That as black women, no, it's not our responsibility to get pressed about something to give you some free promotion. Just go ahead and tell the girls. Because sometimes I feel like black women need to hear it. Lord. Let's see, girl. Um, let's see what kind of comments I get today. Thank you for watching, though. I appreciate I appreciate you watching to the end. Um, until next time, much love, much luck. Peace out.